Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Tomba! Last time we left off, we were exploring the Haunted Mansion, and off-screen, I found the locations of some of the items I was missing. Now, let's see if I even remember where they are. <laughs> um, no, not on the side of the mansion, it was actually on this side. Heading over... And it was in a room I completely missed. Over this way. Ignoring you. <laughs> Let's see. Oops, wrong room. Okay, now I do forget where it is. I could have sworn it was right here. Oh, I remember. It was in the room where the thousand year old chest was. Which is over this way. Get rid of you. I need to also get my skills to level 5. Oh, that was a lucky shot! <laughs> it was one of these rooms, not you. I believe it was you. Was it? Yes, it was. So I'll open the chest, and we get the stone boomerang, which I am equipping right away. There we go. And it was down here. Was anything else down here? No. Nothing else I could do yet. <laughs> I'll admit, I don't remember this game well from the last time I played it, but I'm pretty good at memorizing the locations. Ah! Well, that stopped me from getting eaten. On a plus note. Turning around. Oh, was it the room up here? I forgot there was a, even a room up here. Oh, yeah, I've been in here. Hmm. Apparently, if they see me, I get double the experience. Nice. Yeah, it's, I'm still learning a lot about this game. When I last played it, I was still in elementary school. <laughs> it's a shame my disc doesn't work anymore. This is the um, downloadable version you can get off of the PlayStation Network. Nope, wrong door. <laughs> Haunted Mansion is actually one of the trickiest places to memorize. Everything else is not um directly in the area. It's, oh, it's easier to figure out. I'm still missing a piece by the looks of it, though. Yeah, one more piece. And I think I know where it is? I can always come back later, though. But I would like to know what's in that big room. What's down here? Nothing I can do down here. Hmm. What room am I missing? Oh, I know it's in there. Um. I wonder if it's in the frowning room. Oh well, we'll come back to this later. Heading over. We're actually gonna go back to Phoenix Mountain now. And hopefully not die. Haha. <laughs> now, since we don't know exactly where we landed, you're probably wondering where Phoenix Mountain is. <laughs> Actually, can I talk to the fortune teller yet? Oh! Pink is somewhere really hot. Green is the mansion on the lake. Red is awaiting a miracle. She actually told us something. Huzzah! <laughs> Did she tell us anything else? No. And what she's actually talking about is the color of the evil pigs. And their locations where they're hiding. Of course we need the pig bag first. You can pass now. Get the... Bon... Bonsugi? I've never heard that before. You're pretty strong. You're not gonna move. You're not gonna move. Well, boo. He moved last time! Oh well. But Phoenix Mountain is just outside Bacchus Village. 
Convenient, isn't it? <laughs> Ta-da! Oh, now we have to climb this awful trek once again. Oh. Did I press you? Yes, I did. Oops. Did that again. I can come back for that one later, though. Whoa! That was convenient. Level 5. And Charles is still waiting for us until we find him a new pair of pants. Which isn't too hard. We just have to keep climbing, climbing Phoenix Mountain, that's all. Don't get eaten by you, because you're annoying. Those guys get the weird experience. Dang it! I always screw up that jump! Okay. Get him moving. Ah! <clears throat> you jerk! Dang it! Well, that works. <laughs> okay, don't jump run here. Phew! There we go. There's actually something down there, but trying to aim right is never works for me. But anyways, we're gonna keep going. Who are you? Hmm? Wait a minute, that's it! That's the thousand-year-old key, right there in your hand! I see, so the old man finally found someone who's worthy enough of the key. Well, I guess my job is done then. I don't have a clue as to what's in there, but take good care of whatever it is. A precious treasure chest. I forgot you're actually supposed to come up here first before riding the phoenix, but that never seems to work for me. <gasps> and we got the grapple. The grapple is a nice weapon, but it doesn't do any damage. <laughs> You'll see what I mean later. In there, there was something in there I could have used. There, now I pressed it down. Haha. -ha. Now I gotta go all the way back up. Oh well. And I've pressed those down. So let's just keep going up. Phew. One little graphical glitch there. <sighs> all the way back up. Up, 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 up. Not where I want to land, but I'll take it. Better than getting hit. And eaten. That was weird. Then again, I run into glitches of plenty, so it's not that weird. Okay. There's actually a platform down there, but with the winds like this, I don't want to go down there. Honestly, I think I have to. But in we go. <sighs> the fire pig bag. I can't go any further because of the flames. It was so hard to get here. Hey, I know. Why don't you try to put out the fires? Just kidding. I know it's impossible. Aw, oh, shucks. If we weren't inside a cave, maybe some rain could help put out these flames. By the way, I found this on my way here. Do you know who th those... Do you know whose they are? In any case, I have no use for them. Here, you take them. And we get Charles's pants. Uh, and, as lo uh, along with that, the green evil pig bag. Now I need to go back to the Hundred Flower Forest. Lava caves. And get a freaking smiling mushroom! I need to get a couple healing mushrooms, too. One for me and one for Baron. Actually, two for me. I got the frowning door, too. And I can't do anything else because the wind would just knock us down the pit. And when you die, it respawns you in the last location you exited from. So, I'm actually gonna go get Charles first. Ah! If I don't die in the process! <laughs> Doot -doot. Doot. And we'll talk to Charles. Come on, talk to Charles. There we go. Oh, right, I gotta give them to him. 
Ay ay ay. <laughs> so much to do, so little time. Anyways, Charles's pants. Hey, where did you find these? Thanks! Now I can get up and go home. <laughs> oh wait, here, take this. It's the least I can do. And we get the funky parasol. Just equip yourself with it and you'll automatically op it'll automatically open when you jump. The parasol will slow down the speed that you fall. If you press down direction the down directional button, you can increase the speed of your descent. If you catch the right wind, you can maneuver yourself in a good to a good spot. Got it? See you later. And the parasol is your best friend. Oops! I forgot about that. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh, well, quick way back! <laughs> now that we're actually out of the winds, let us equip the funky parasol. And head this way. We can actually traverse the flower forest with ease. At least I think it's called the flower forest. Don't quote me on that. First, I want to see what's in this chest. Let me see. There we go. Mysterious mushroom! Oh, that makes things so easy for us. Now we don't actually have to, um... Um, 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 what's the word? Eat any of the mysterious mushrooms. And there's actually a healing mushroom that does the same thing, if I can find it. I was next. I didn't think it would open up in time, you little jerk. Up! And... In here? It's a thousand-year-old bell. Yay! Let's see. What's over here? I can't quite remember. There's a hundred-year-old chest. I'll take that. Ooh! And you guys. You gonna come back here? Because I'd love you to glitch. <laughs> that happens a lot, actually, in this game. These guys are unique. Oh, come on! I landed on your head. And I missed again. Maybe getting these guys at this angle isn't the easiest thing to do. One. Come on. You guys are slow. Two. And three. Monster hunt. Oh, some of these I remember quite well. And we get the Rise and Shine Powder, which actually will wake up a certain flower. I just need to remember which flower that is. And those guys will never come back. Yay! AP box! Yeah. And what's our reward for this box? The Ordinary Mushroom! Yes! Oh, I'm happy now! I don't need to come back here ever again. Well, for now. At least for the mushrooms. Oh, come on. Press. This door actually leads somewhere, I just can't remember if you can go this way right now. I think it's a quick shortcut to the Haunted Mansion. Ready. No trespassing danger. There are monsters living in this forest. Do not enter. Buckus Village Nature Management. Hmm. I didn't realize they worked over here. Ah! That was annoying. Okay, there's actually other chests in here too. waiting for him, because he'll actually hurt me if I land on the chest. Ah! That's the one downside to this umbra uh, parasol, is your descent is still s fairly slow. And I do want that item, so actually what I'm gonna do is just gonna land here and unequip the parasol for a minute.